Good evening, everyone. Good evening, Jonathan, Nicholas. Uh, we've had some extraordinary hosts of the Men of the Year Awards. We've had uh, Elton John, Lily Allen, David Walliams, um, James Nesbitt, most of the important comedians in the country, but we've never had the most successful actor in Hollywood history. So Samuel L. Jackson, everyone. The, uh, the winner of the writer uh, of the Year Award is something of a, uh, a television celebrity. We're always being told that TV is the new something or other, the new novel, the new Hollywood, the new TV, but very few people have elevated TV to the extent that this man has, which is why the likes of Matthew McConaughey, Woody Harrelson, Vince Vaughn, and Colin Farrell have all clamored for parts in his shows. Please give a huge GQ round of applause for the writer of True Detective, Nick Pizzolatto. Thank you very much. She twines his mind up slowly towards the um, Thank you very much. Thank you, Dylan. And uh, I'm incredibly honored and, and flattered and humbled to receive this. GQ's been an icon my whole life. Uh, I think I read my first issue at like 12, which in South Louisiana in the late 80s caused a lot of questions from my father. <laughs> But look at me now, Dad. It says man. Um, he's a great guy, actually. Uh, the, I've been very fortunate to work for and with uh, amazing people, but the person I need to thank tonight the most is my wife, Amy, who, she's right over there. Um, gave me a home and a family and held it all together while I kept changing. And, um, you know, married me at a time where I, I was a good candidate for guy least likely to ever earn a dime. And, and I remember that, and, and thank you, sweetheart, I love you. Thank you.